happen again. Um, but hi everybody, welcome back if you were in that last video, and welcome back if we haven't hung out in a while. Alright. Yeah. Um, but anyway, here we go. Life is Strange, Chapter 4. Finally! Finally! Um, it's gonna be great. So... I know, I know, I know, people have been waiting for this, so, let's, let's do this. Let's get in there, yeah? Second run, that's right, that's right, Diego Gamer, second run. Alright. Hey look, it's available. Ta-da! Alright. Hopefully no problems. Hopefully, yeah. Hopefully it's not gonna crash on us again, or it's gonna be like, you can't stream, and all that jazz. I'll, I'll give it a few seconds, but in case there's some people who were in that last video who wanna get back in here, and are just getting notifications and whatnot. But, yeah. Fun game. Fun times. There's a lot of great games right now that are... That are being things. If you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying. Like, we got... Okay, see, why is this being all glitchy? Okay, there it goes. There it goes. Okay. Alright! Let's get started. Chapter 4, Dark Room. YouTube is being dumb with the notifications. Really? Oh, that's lame. Mickey D. Gouch and Barry, what's up? Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, also, yeah, I guess I should probably... Um, maybe? I don't think so. Don't worry, Jeremathias is here, hanging out. I haven't found a good place to put him yet. If if you haven't noticed, I actually moved um, where I'm streaming. I'm doing it in my room now so that uh, I don't have to bother my roommates with all my noise and shenaniganry. I was I was originally doing it out in the living room, but now I'm doing it um, in in my room so that it's not so noisy for them and. We can game in peace together, and I can be as loud as I well, maybe not as loud as I want. I know, I know, I like to scream, but um, we can be louder and and hang out, and they can do their thing. I don't have to disrupt the living space. Um, so I'm in my room now. Um, yeah, maybe that would have worked, um, but I didn't have the fourth chapter downloaded. So um, alternative beach. Um, so I don't know if that would have worked. I downloaded it. It took, I don't know, ten minutes Previously or so. Previously so. Life is Strange. Whoa. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Matt? Oh, man, come Stop. on. Stop! Don't come near me! Not now. It won't work. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Caulfield, please, tell us everything. Will do, sir. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find uh, Rachel's. That's what people have been telling me. Like they were like, do chapter four already. Room. It's the best chapter. Look, I'm like, my okay. Room. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? Maybe she my doesn't want to go around town telling Hello? everybody. Well, I guess they were like best friends, but. Do you know what it's like to wait for Maybe she was embarrassed she was banging Frank. Maybe Ever Frank since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am 
awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> I don't know. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Beached whales were friends Max with. Cranfield. <clears throat> Who's on. the? Crap, I forgot Ready? her name. You the... have a visitor. The B word girl. This is already hitting me. Oh no, the feels. Yep, so. Where we left off. Life is Strange is based on a story, a game of the future is played, but the consequences. Alright, choose wisely. Um, we, we changed the past so that Chloe's dad is alive, but now Chloe's in a wheelchair. So. Uh oh. I guess nobody died though. Well, okay. I guess Kate still. Oh, wait! I don't know if Kate died in this alternate timeline. Maybe she did. Maybe that isn't affected. And oh, and the guy who likes us, Warren, I'm pretty sure that was his name. He, uh, he's with some other girl now. <laughs> What's that about? What? We're irresistible. How could he be with somebody else? Well. No, I'm kidding. I can see why. There's all these beached whales. Man. Freaking whales. Freaking whales. But you know what? We still have the great music. That's all I have to say. We still have the great music. Which, you know. Can you really go wrong with great music? I don't think so. I don't think so. You know, okay, so, well, no one's talking. Although there are beached whales, and it's although weird hanging oh, out with you again, I know. I'll talk about this later. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even uh -huh. wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max, so pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. Don't cry. What if the I'll, I'll, up? I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Oh. <sighs> Wait, what? Oh, William's her dad, right? Okay. Um... No. I'm not gonna blame William, right? Am am I wrong? Rose Puff, what's up? Welcome back. Am I wrong in thinking that w William is her dad, right? That that's who that's who William is. <laughs> Parents say smoking is bad. Look what that got, Chloe. <laughs> well, smoking is bad. 
All right, I'm gonna say talk about the accident, okay not blame one. Talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. Official prediction? I felt my back snap. Oh, wait. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. I'll say <laughs> man they're already starting okay for right now I'll since I have a moment to just like make a decision nobody's gonna be talking so first of all they're already starting off with making me make tons of decisions which dang it was Frank that hit oh wait you can't say that I didn't know that okay well so now I forgot what I was gonna say um oh this this is what I was gonna say. Although there are beached whales there there are beached whales there are an an uh, injured permanent per, yeah, permanently injured Chloe. Um was there a third thing that looked bad in this situation? I don't know that there was. Oh, I, I guess the other third situation was we're friends with that one girl who I don't remember her name. Can I press pause and find out? Yes, I can. Uh, oh, Victoria. Apparently we're friends with Victoria now. Um... Oh, you were lying? Mm, I don't know. It was just a joke. Well, okay. So, although those three things exist, and as far as I know, I mean, okay, and Warren's not, which I don't really care too much about, which maybe Max does, but um, I don't care too much about that Warren is with some other girl right now. Or some, I mean, maybe nothing's happening with that girl, but it seemed to indicate that he's interested in somebody else besides us. So... There's those four things, which I could see as those are the cons at this moment in time. Maybe this is bad to say because it's like choosing the difference between... Which I guess we don't know what the pros and cons for Rachel would have been in this situation. I guess her being missing has nothing to do with her being friends with Chloe, so we don't really know. Um... Or at least I don't know. Maybe all of you know. But I was going to say, this is looking like a better situation. Because although Chloe is injured, at least both her dad and her are alive. Um, the Victoria thing, I would actually see that as maybe as a positive. Chloe's real dad dies. All right, Scarlet, you're gonna get frickin', frickin', um, whatevered if you keep talking like that. Um, whatever. Even if I'm, you're probably just making fake tellings about what could happen, but even still. Um, Chloe's real dad dies. You got boyfriend, but when he lives. You don't know, does that change? Well, okay, but I don't want to know anything about the future. So, no more of that. Or you're being deported, or I don't know. I don't know what it's called when you get silenced in these things. Restricted from chat. Um, okay, anyway, let's get into this. Let's, let's go in and find out what actually is going to happen, Mr. Fista Scarlet. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna say you mean Rachel. You mean Rachel Amber? 
When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did? This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Oh crap, I didn't... After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. You think? It might be. <laughs> That's kind of depressing. I like to think we can still change things for the better. Yeah, like good. But I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, but as long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're, I think this game awesome. came out I in... I think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? Oh, that was some shade right hell there. It's cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. Uh-oh. None taken. So, maybe our relationship isn't that great either. Which... To be honest, though, I wouldn't say that our relationship in the other universe was really that great either, too. Chloe definitely had some pretty, like, harsh feelings towards us because we left. So, I don't know. What year did this game come out? I, for some odd reason, I want to say 2014, but I'm not sure. Maybe 2015. Because I don't think it came out in 2016. Did it? Maybe it did. I don't know. It came out a while ago. I know that for sure. It's a pretty high-tech lair. Feels like a high-tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. Oh, I could see that. They're grateful you are here with them. 2015? Right. Nice. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. Yeah. You're kind and sensitive when you don't even have to be. Trust me. I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Oh, is this the garage? Lifter. Oh, man. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. At least, Chloe doesn't weigh that much. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? She can't even feel the grass now. Mm. Lamp. And that's a serious heat lamp. That was interesting. Oh, the snow dough. I guess not everything changed. Oh, that's like our guiding spirit of some sort. Hello, Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. Fluffy animals. Snow globes are taking over. Yeah, Chloe, come on. Just kidding. Bathroom. Bathroom area. Gas mask optional. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I want to look at... Oh, what is this? Whoa, Chloe can totally control her computer. Oh, I see. It's so great people get this high-tech help. Oh, should I use her computer? Chloe is still a punk at heart. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Hot Wheels chat room. Oh! 
That's fantastic. Miss Blue, so what are you doing talking with you? Ha <laughs> ha, no shit. Oh, ooh. I mean, no bleep. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Uh, I'm about to binge on Quantum Leap. Man! Oh my gosh. OMG, love, Scott Bakula. <laughs> School rules. <laughs> so do you. I hope we can meet soon. Now if you're in San Francisco, hey, I have to take care of some body work. Let me get back to you in a while. You're binging on Bakula. You better. Hello? Okay, that was kind of weird. The Black Attic Club. Dancing at the club, playing at the club, doing things at the club. Club, a club, a club. Oh, I'm supposed to go in the bathroom. Oh, boy. Chloe's message board since the accident. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. I wonder who this is. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. Dear Chloe, I'm so sorry for what happened. Know that I'm here for you if you need anything. I hope you feel better and hope to see you again. XOXO, Megan. Oh, Megan. Who's Megan? Trying to get on that best friend status? Uh-uh, Chloe's our best friend. Chloe, just thought I'd drop you up. I'd drop you a quick note to let you know I'm thinking about you. Feel so lame writing shit down. Crap, I swore again. Writing bleep down, like, I hope you are well, etc. I know your life is so different now. I don't know. I don't want that to get in the way of our friendship. Yes, I haven't been around lately, but that will change soon. I hope you are well. At least I oh, sent thanks. road trip selfies to Chloe. I'm sure that made her feel great. Yeah. Ian Brown, what is up? Welcome to the stream. Mm. Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. Wait. They're so great. Uh, okay, she's like, Max can I get my drink on? Oh, there's a cup right here. <laughs> wow, okay. Drink up, buttercup. Oh, that was kind of cute. Drink up, buttercup. Oh, man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod uh -oh. in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a <laughs> You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. Huh. <sighs> Seems like we were kids in another life. What do you remember? You're right. Seems like yesterday. Um. <laughs> I'll say. Yeah, I'll say seems like Wait, yesterday. It seems like yesterday we were little brats here, watching Power Rangers and destroying the kitchen. Oh my god. We okay, that was a good power. choice. I was thinking, was like, that was that's so what weird. I would say, but also, like... But a long time ago. You're the only person that I grew up with who visits me. As you can see, I can't... Reminder of the good time. times. As you can see, I can't... I can't keep on everything. Uh, which friends? Ooh, I feel like that's kind of something harsh to say. Which friends? I should stop talking while they're talking. <laughs> Not used to that. Um, who watches Power Rangers though? Is Power Rangers still a thing? I don't have television. I mean, I watched it when I was a kid, but I haven't watched it in a while. You have me. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. Yeah, that's what I was afraid she was going to say. But I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not Supermax. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. First of all, okay. <laughs> I've, been, I've had a lot to comment on on this, on this video. First of all, 
that was like a total guilt trip was like if she didn't have a problem with it i'm back what's up spam masubi gaming um if she didn't have a problem with me like being gone then she wouldn't have said something like that she would have like just been like well i'm glad you're here now or something like that but um and the other thing is like too like just because you have a like are going through a rough time doesn't mean that because other people like have to live their lives like i don't know you can get mad at them for not uh i don't know that's just my thought maybe other people have different thoughts about that but yeah are you lonely are you okay are they okay they love you hmm i feel like Part of me wants to be, like, the reassuring friend and just being like, they love you. But knowing Chloe, I feel like she's going to be like, you're just saying that. You should add dramatic music to that speech. Was it really, was it that good or that dramatic about it? I don't know. <laughs> oh, maybe I will. Maybe I will. Um... Okay. I'm gonna say they love you. They love you so much. I know. Okay, good. My mom and dad are so cute. They oh, always good. Come here and make sure everything's okay with me. I think Joyce and William are incredible. I look like Jake Paul. Yes. <laughs> the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. I'm just gonna say I bet. I bet. This tech must be crazy expensive. Along with the drugs, the nurses, the supplies. Is that mom and dad are always broke. Is that disrespect? So I don't worth it. I don't know if I've ever been Good called princess. Jake Paul. I don't know if I really even know. Uh, oh, okay, actually yes, it is who I thought it was. <laughs> you are such a kid. I could see that kind of. That's why I love you. Of course I know but... it when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Oh, ha 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 ha. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. On me like you always do when you watch movies. I remember, Max. Swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. Oh, this was another thing I had to comment on. Was I mean, this isn't really a comment, but like, okay, I, they've clearly done like the kind of like. I don't know, I don't know exactly what, but, like, kind of the stereotypical, I don't know, you know, like, they've had, like, Star Wars references and Ghostbusters and, I don't know, like, they, what is, what is that technically now? It's, like, the, like, Blade Runner and what, they just referenced something else, too, that I was like, yes. I don't know, but, like, I feel like they've just been killing the reference trains. I don't know. It, there's there's a culture behind it, and I don't know what it's technically called, but pirate power. Oh, that's all it says. Wait, wait. Blade Runner's not in there. Oh, maybe it's in here. Aha! Here's the DVD. Aha! But they've been nailing it. I'm definitely a cheese head for like. Oh, it's like pop culture, I guess, is probably a good way of identifying it. But, like, I love pop culture references and, like, things. I don't know. I think it's fun. Those those self-aware games. Wow. It's not just games. Movies, too. Did you say they're to make it? Oh, they made a Quantum Leap reference. Oh, look at how happy she is. Oh. Did you see that little smile? That was adorable! Oh, Chloe actually cares. Not that I didn't think she didn't care, but... 
she like really cares. It's like making her really happy. Power Rangers, Blade Runner, Lord of the Rings, and the Butterfly Effect. Yeah, all references. Exactly, yeah. There's there's a lot of them in this. Oh, they had a reference to The Shining, too, with a like dorm room 217 or whatever. 237. Uh-oh, we fell asleep that time. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. Oh. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do, you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Did you watch it? Did I watch what? Sorry, the I new Blade Runner? Awake like me. No. I didn't know it was out. I'm sorry Oops. I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have but yes, I have seen the original Blade Runner. You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Oh, um, no, I, ha I have seen the original It. it I have great. not seen the new It movie. I really want to see it, though. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like we were little pirates jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go? Yeah, I've heard it's really good. I'm excited morphine for it. Injector in the bathroom. Morphine injector? It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You Star Trek. Like a needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can. Nice. Nice, Diego Gamer. Nice. I'm on it, Chloe. <laughs> okay. Again, this is gonna sound like really bad. Okay, crap. I didn't hear what she said. Oh, okay. I'm going in here. You thought it could have been scarier? I have heard that too. Oh, look, an Eiffel Tower. Bonjour. That's great. We finally went to Paris. Yeah. Oh. Oh, is that? I got a text message or something? I should look at all these text messages. Hey Max, it's a shame that you hang out with those people. I thought you were different. Alyssa, I thought you throw that TP at me. Oh my god. I was not aiming at you, I swear. Don't do it again. Whoa! Max is feisty! Expert gamer, what's up? Um, the field train are coming. Chloe, what do you have to say for you? Cool. Oh, there's a lot more. Hello, Max. This is William. If you wanted to contact Chloe, you can use this number. She'd love to hear from you. See you soon. I hope. Bye. Hey, Chloe. Maxine here. I know it's been a while. I just wanted to let you know. I'm going to Blackwell Academy now. I hope this is still your number. Max is back. Blackwell, this is awesome. You rule. Best of all, we can hang again. So yes, this is still my number. Cool, I've got a buttload of homework, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me, it's been too long. I know, I'll see you soon. Okay. Nathan. Yo, yo, Max, you around? Uh-oh, we're friends with Nathan. I mean, okay, but here's the other thing. So, which maybe it's not going to be that way. So, in that alternate timeline, I don't know how much this has changed other people, but like in that alternate timeline, uh, Nathan and Victoria were like huge jerks. And they might still be. They, they might still be really bad people who I shouldn't be hanging out with. But who knows? Maybe because of this alternate timeline, they're not. They're, they're cooler, they're cooler people. Maybe they're not, maybe they're not, maybe they're just normal, cool people. It's not just that we're friends with them in this timeline and they're still jerks. Why were you gone? Oh man, so many reasons. I was out of town for a while and school and rehearsals and work and trying to figure out when a good time to start doing my streams again. So it's it's been a little crazy. Um, in the dark room, developing shots for the contest. Wait, what? Oh, I, not like shots, like shots. Sweet. So no two whales for you. Not yet. I'll see you guys later though. Peace out. 
Taylor. Max, thanks again for taking me to see my mom. I think she wants you for a daughter instead of me. I think now your mom is B.A. like you. Yeah, right. I cried like a B word. So did I. You just didn't see me. It's okay to cry. It gets old. My stupid phone is about to die, so call me back. Okay, why was she crying? Confused. Oh, mom. Sorry, I, I know there's a lot, a lot of text messages. Oh, this is, this is old. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's 18 years old. Since you brought, you were brought to us, Maxine. This is your mom. We need to talk uh, about some of your bills. Uh oh, are you there? Yes, give me some time to answer. I can't just text in every class. Some teachers get super pissed when people use their phones. Okay, most teachers do. Um, yes, because it's super rude, and please don't be so nippy. Sorry, long day of homework. You're not the only one, and that's why we're wondering if you need to spend so much. We want you to have everything you need, but your scholarship doesn't cover everything. You said I could use your credit card when I needed it. I only bought film, not a camera. Maybe it's time to go digital. I'll call you later, I have to go. Don't pout, love you. Hey honey, I hope you didn't forget to put the water in the plant. Okay. I think, I feel like those were all old. I don't know. Max, the busy girl, ha. Avoiding, sorry, that was so rude. Um, avoiding homework as usual. I told, I told you I'd help you out. You never let me help. T.O.T. What is T.O.T.? I don't know what that is. Okay, drama, stop. And you help me by caring. I do try. By the way, I scored the killer bud for you know who. I scored the killer bud from you know who. Am I like 50 years old? Okay, I know what FY. FYI means for your information, but like what does that mean? Is she talking about like I found a cute boy or is like I Scored that killer bud or is she talking about like beer cuz like bud like be bud light. I don't know. Okay Save me. Oh, it's wow. I just literally needed to read the next text. It's it's uh It's weed. All right Save me a bowl gotta bounce ttyl Come by my room tonight. All right. I'm missing a lot of things in chat. This reminds me of Night in the Woods. Yeah, I was I was doing a little Night in the Woods different uh, words. Sharkle, come back, please. Well, maybe if they do like a DLC or a second Night in the Woods or something. Is the weed she ta is the weed she talking about? The weed. Yes, you were so right. It was the weed. All right. Let's. Okay. Oh, another text message. Max. Are we cool? Just wanted to make sure since you walked away so fast. Nathan was worried too. If you want to talk, hit me up, okay? Love you. Max, if you're mad, just tell me. Okay? Okay. Silence. So if you want to talk, my door is open. Love you. Okay. These people are the worst kind of people. Well, no, okay, they're not the worst kind of people. I mean, Chloe, for a number of reasons, is one of the worst kind of people. But, all right. I know we live in a day and age where Facebook and, you know, instant messaging and text messages are, and everyone usually has their phone on them. But, do not get mad at people if they don't respond within, okay, two minutes, and then another two minutes. So within four minutes, think that they're upset with you for some reason, because they might be doing something. They might be in a meeting. They might be at work. They might be in class. They might be doing things. And I know this like is somewhat of a regular thing, but like if it's been a few days and people aren't responding, then maybe get worried. But like these two minutes, it's like oh my gosh, just like. Settle yourself. Settle yourself before you wreck yourself. All right. Oh yeah. Also yeah. For people who didn't hear, um, part another part of the reason is I'm actually in my room now, so I'm in a different area. I used to be out in my living room, and now I'm in my room, so that if I do late night streams or anything like that, it doesn't bother my roommates as much. 
Um, and if they're in the living room or out in the kitchen, like they can kind of do their own thing. And then we are undisturbed and they're undisturbed by me doing the streams. So that's why I'm, I'm doing in my rooms now. So I did a little rearrangement. So I don't know if this will be the permanent spot of the camera. Um, it, it seems like a good spot for me, um, but I'll fiddle around with it and see what I like best. This will probably be it, but yeah. So there's, there's those things. Okay. Apparently the field trains are coming, so let's get to these field trains. Hey, Am I bothering you? Why yes, Why Max, I love going, going through bills. bills. <laughs> Kidding. Kidding. How, can How can you bother, bother me? me? I haven't, I haven't seen, seen you in forever. forever. I, know, oh, I know. He's nice. You look you exactly, exactly the same. same. <laughs> it's so cool. Good. Good. Or I'd be, I'd scared, be scared if I didn't look, I didn't look like, like me. me. <laughs> of course, oh, you that, seem more adult. That southern so what's charm. Um, next, Paris trip. Let's ask about the so Paris trip. We made it to Paris. Oui, as they say. Uh oh, you can hear double. <laughs> me because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience, especially for Chloe. I can see her loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like oh. that. She talked about okay. going to school there, but that's not practical anymore. Let's see if this helps. It's not fair, Max. Okay, just a second. Okay, I didn't want to do this, but we might have to do this. All right. That's weird that it just started, though. Okay. Um, how's this? How, how does this sound? Is this sounding better? Yes, no, maybe so. Or, or maybe the echo is coming from uh, Chloe. I don't know how to say this, but I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change a girl's whole life. But she's alive. She's been a trooper. Okay. Good. Okay, yeah, I was trying to see if... Which, it's kind of disappointing that that's happening. Well, I'll figure it out later. I'll just do this for now. Because um, I was I wanted to start using the camera recorder because it's a lot better than anything I have. Um, but I'll, I'll figure it out later. I'll figure it out later. Um, is she mad at me? Glad you're here. I'm going to say glad she you're here. She's amazing. I'm so glad you're here to help her and be her father. I'm so glad Joyce is here to help us both. Max, I just hate to think of what would happen to Chloe if I wasn't here. William, I just want you to know that whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. Always. I know you will, Max. Okay. I was impressed by Chloe's room and all the high-tech equipment. <laughs> you should be. Uh -huh. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. Um, the insurance helps, but uh, I don't know, Max. I know it the must airport broke be hard for you guys <laughs> so, financially. These bills yeah, I was like a little mad crushing. about that. We have to mortgage our home, and that's pretty scary. But, but we'll get through it. The price is always right. Get it? No? I took them with me back to Minnesota when I went home for my sister's wedding and they broke on the airplane so that sucked being around you and Joyce again is so nostalgic very old school as they say <laughs> I think it's great for Chloe to see you makes Joyce happy too so it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay yeah or is it Oh. Um, wow, that's a lot of things to ask him. Rip headset, indeed. Crazy what weather. What is going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? 
It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. But all I actually care about now is Chloe and Joyce. My yeah. family. Family. Um, Rachel Amber. I was reading about that missing girl. Rachel Amber. Oh, yes, yeah, she went to Blackwell, right? Oh, poor thing. That's a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. Oh. Sounds like you know them well. More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. I don't even like to think about it. I have to go see if Chloe needs anything. It was so great talking with you again. Wait, we know she needs something. like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. Yeah, I kind of forgot. I got caught up in talking about things and... Getting mad at Victoria again. <laughs> um, but where, where was where was the? Uh, yes, I believe I will play uh, Back to the Future. Uh, Life is strange. Um, just kidding. Uh, but yeah. Yay, Rose Puff back. Okay, where was the the head the morphine? Go stairs to the bathroom. Okay, thank you. That's what I thought, but I wasn't sure. Oh, well, I knew I had to go to some bathroom, but I wasn't I wasn't sure which bathroom. Okay. Oh yeah, let's 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 go in her old room. Oh. Quite the different story. A blue butterfly? I'm sure this is a total coincidence. I'm sure. It's not the universe trying to talk to you. I guess we stopped growing up together. Oh no, the feels! Oh, yeah. I never heard much about William's brother. Hey, Bill. Sorry for not staying in touch since the accident. Work has been pulling up and I'm being sent out to Salt Lake City! If anybody doesn't know, that's that's where I live currently. <laughs> so. Um, to oversee a new parking lot. You have to go where the work is these days. I wish I could have sent you a bigger check but you know the story money is nobody's favorite thing rip chloe bedroom rip chloe bedroom maybe i'll see you next spring for a visit kiss chloe and joyce for me hang in there billy your brother aaron all right okay um Crutches. Oh, there's another letter. We can look at that. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Dear Joyce, thank you for, for keeping me updated on Chloe's condition. can only imagine the struggle you and William are going through. I'm so sorry that I can't help you with alone at this time. Like everybody else, I'm underwater with my own medical bills. Please give Chloe a hug and my best wishes. Love, Aunt Dorothy. Oh. Wait. So, they're related to them? What? I'm confused. It's a great city. I like it. Okay. Ah, here we are. Um, it's dark in here. Can we, uh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, is this gonna be another one of those things where, like... Oh, let's look in How's the mirror. How's it going, Time Tripper? Funny. I think I look older. Oh. The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Are the are the lakes salty? Well, Here one lake is salty. The rest I of them are just I'd be delivering just normal. To my best friend. Just normal lakes. Oh, oh, here was another Not thing I was going to say. Okay. Again, it sucks that Chloe is having a bad time and she's basically 
Well, no, she is. She's paralyzed from the neck down. But not to it's encourage drug use, but when I had surgery when I was younger, I was given morphine and switch off the light, energy con conservation right there. I got morphine, and morphine is it's all about fun. You, Arcane, okay? <laughs> That's Isn't all I'll it? say on that matter. <laughs> I did not. I did not. Uh, I'm not gonna open that door. That's rude. It's someone else's room. I did not. I did enjoy my time being on prescribed morphine. Prescribed. Prescribed so. by a doctor. By a doctor. Say Bloody Mary with the lights off. You know, I've tried that and nothing happened, so maybe I wasn't doing it right. Finally. But uh, give me the blue pill. I don't know about I'm that sorry. one. I'm nosy, but, but not precise. Go ahead. Yeah, I mean, I didn't really like Chloe in the it's last, so in the alternate world. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Did I screw up? Of course, up? my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. I was about to say, do I not know what emo is? <laughs> Cause, I mean, okay. Despite everything, they're still a happy family again. It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating, too. Um. Okay. Oh, man. I don't want to cry. I don't want to cry. I don't want to cry. Uh, okay. There you go, girl. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god, look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. I don't want to turn the page. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. All right, I'll relax. Oh, that was rough. That was rough. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo. Maybe I could. Oh. Oh. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing. No. Uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents no. suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm no! Saying being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Oh my God. 
Lord. Yes, Why? I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. What? No! No! What? I'm walking away. I just, no, I'm done. What? No. Oh my gosh, I was not ready for this. Okay, this changes everything from what I said earlier. <sighs> Man, oh my gosh, what? Okay, give me a second, because this is ridiculous. Okay, thank you. Thank you for letting me, everyone wants me to kill her, oh my god. Everyone hates Chloe. Or maybe doesn't hate her, but maybe they just think, yeah, put her out of her misery. Okay. So. I could accept to kill her. Chloe dies happy, I guess. I mean, maybe happy is the wrong word, but like content with it because it's her choice and that's how she wants things to go. And yeah, ending her misery. The downside to that is like, well, one, Chloe dies, but apparently she's gonna die no matter what. So that kind of counteracts that. The other kind of bad thing is her parents, like, what were her parents think? Okay, Rosebuff is saying she lived a good life, she needs to die. Yeah, for real, zero to a hundred in a second. Oh my gosh. Okay, third of all, how can you just drop that on your friend? Like, th this is like the first, I mean, I guess we hung out all night and stuff, but like, this is the first time we've seen her in years. Who? <sighs> See, okay, so part of me wants to accept, even though that would be hard. Oh, the game just automatically paused on me because I took too long to make a choice. <laughs> um. Say, I don't know. Yeah, exactly. Like. <sighs> I'm gonna accept. I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna kill her. Chloe, I'll just drift to sleep, dreaming of us here together. What kind Forever. of a person does that make me sound like? You know? Thank 
Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Okay, so here, here, for the people who said I should have done I don't know, the reason I didn't want to do that was because I wanted to, I wanted to do a definitive side for it. And maybe, maybe I don't know, I would have gotten more information. Um, oh my god. <sighs> oh my god. Okay, so... Is that my only option? Like, I can't just, like, get up and leave? I guess not. I'm sorry, William. <laughs> so, if I would have rejected... If I would have rejected, yeah, that makes me a little upset. If I would have rejected or said, I don't know, we would have stayed in this alternate timeline longer. See, okay. So, so yeah, so. So, okay, here, which maybe, maybe things are going to pan out in a certain way and, like, I'm going to have another decision to kill Chloe or to kill her dad. Um, but, like, okay, here's the problem with giving someone such a choice. I mean, okay, maybe it's just to get your feels going, like you're, you're all saying, and it's just to troll you. But... I made the choice to let her go. But now the game at the same time still isn't giving you that choice. Because, okay, maybe if I would have refused to, maybe it still would have... Okay. 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 See, like, I don't know. It's, it's, it's one of those games where it's like a false choice, you know? Because it's like, you either get to kill her or you get... Or you either don't get to kill her or you don't get to kill her. It's just how you don't kill her. Which, I guess, yeah, I'm sure later on I'll have to choose again. But, no, I made the choice. We're going with that choice. And we're going back in time. Why not? Yeah. You get to go again. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where am I? I do kind of... That's a dollar for the square jar. Okay, and that was the other thing. I thought if I accept her death... Aha! You can't hide from me forever. I would get to spend more time... And no Chloe and Max want... In... Okay, so whenever I do the same thing happens, great. I was gonna say, I was hoping I get to spend more time in the alternate timeline and figure out more about about that timeline. Because okay, here here was my initial problem. So 
Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll okay, I feel like that's back. gonna have very negative ramifications. Always. And now we're gonna be in like a third alternate timeline. Well, of course we are. Oh no. Funeral. Not with her dad. Punker kid. Hiker. No more champagne. Remarried. New car. Oh, knife fight. Car crash. Rachel and Chloe. Wheelchair. Prescott trying to shoot her. Hospital bed. Um, I don't know what that's supposed to be. Us on the stairs doing something. Is she holding a board or like a skateboard? I couldn't tell. Now I bet Victoria and us are not going to be friends again. Are we finally going to get to go see Planet of the Apes with Warren? That's what I'm wondering. Because I was actually really excited about that, and then the timeline changed, and that didn't happen. Oh. Chloe, you're alive. Yes. Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss, now you're all over me? Ha. Uh, I'm just... I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. The real Let's world? Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Nice. Oh, look at the big board. So Kate's still dead, clearly. So close, yet so far away. Oh, have to do three NSFW. Things. Right. I didn't even notice um, that poster. What things? Or maybe I'm just re-noticing it. One, decipher it's been Frank's a while. Log book. To get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. That means two Dude, things. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Thank you. Thank you, you Scarlet. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. Future lady. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm going to cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not going to be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I mean... I think the story is about I a lot of things, but I think the main me. thing is like it's way too dangerous and saving Chloe or saving her dad. Messing up the past. I think that's kind of the main two choices in that sense. I feel like that's kind of the main story. I mean, 
the storm, I guess, whatever, but I feel like that has to do with Chloe and her dad, too. Um, but, I mean, in this, in this timeline, we're trying to figure out things about Nathan Prescott and her Chloe stepdad, because we think they're bad people. I'm but. so sorry, William. It's not fair you had to die twice. Well, he didn't. Just to you, he did. I should have known just erasing that phone message wouldn't stop the police. What? Miss Price, this is Officer Anderson Barry, and since we have contact info on file here, we'd like you to come by the station on Monday morning at approximately 8 a.m. to answer a few questions about any information you may have regarding a recent break-in at Black... Oh, I think we read this last time. Rip, William. Yeah. This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. For real. How much time have I altered since? I don't know, girl. But you're gonna be like 80 by the end of this story. All right, where am I going? I'm going downstairs, get some dirt on her dad. Stepdad, sorry, stepdad, stepdad. Okay. Oh. Since David might be in there, I better mosey along for a change. Oh yeah. The one chance I was actually gonna go in there to find dirt on this dude, he, it doesn't let you go in that room, which is kind of funny. <laughs> oh. What's up? What you doing? You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. Oh, that's right. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you, ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. That's right. Too late. We got them Isn't divorced. It? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. You know, here's another question. William seems like a good dad, but is he actually a really bad dad? And David seems like a really bad dad, but is he actually a really good dad? Or maybe I'm just reading into that too much. What? Chloe? Okay. Uh, um, how far back does this message go? I don't know. It's so hard to tell. Okay, that is your one. Get out of the emoji for car. Get that S down here now. Hey man, I suck again. Sorry, I got in your face today and took out my BS rage on my best friend. Chloe, I understand you're going through a lot. We all are. Besides, I threw your beanie out the window and busted out my rewind. Okay, this is your one get out of emoji jail free card, but we need to stock up on cigs, coffee, and candy for an all-nighter. We have to get into Rachel and Kate detective mode. Excellent. Dear Watson, I'll bring my thinking cap. No worries. I have a beanie. I'll swing by and pick you up. Sweet. I'll be ready. XOXO. And that's... That was no emoji. I, I'm confused. That's Nathan. He knows, I think. Still old bear. Sorry, my phone was in my bag. Hey, Justin, you busy? My Max Wax, I'm busy blazing. What up? Do you know Frank Bowers? Drugs. That's it? That's Nathan. He knows him, I think. Okay, I'm on it. Thanks, Justin. For what? Okay. It's a thing called overprotected. If you rewind time, what happens to the 50 multiple timelines? Do they live on? You know, that's a good question. I do not know. Because I guess in the sense of multi-verse theory, there is a, a belief that there are infinite number of universes which have already made all those decisions and are already all being lived out all at the same time. 
Um, so in another universe, I ch ch Max chose or I chose to do something else. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. I guess if it's a singular universe, though, then everything that's undone or redone or double done or undone or gotten rid of or repeated or redone or, you know, then technically it would change and that those timelines wouldn't exist. Uh, Mom, why do you send me such long text messages? Um, as long as you're around, I, are these really new? Miss Clawfield, I wanted to thank you so much for your actions with my daughter, Kate. You showed true grace and bravery when you went up to that roof. I think we already read that. Hey, Max, this is Richard March again. I wanted to let you know that Kate's service is next week. Yeah, we already read all these. Warren. Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds hot, so I get why. All right, Warren. Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't have her number. At least I still get to go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe or we could all go. One pain in the A word is enough. Cool. I have to jet TTYL. Okay. David is a dad that doesn't understand people. Chloe hates strict people. That's what I think why she hates her dad. Yeah, I think so too. Ain't nothing like a good sake. Hey now, don't smoke. Smoking's bad. I don't endorse smoking. Sorry. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Maybe. Email. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. I didn't need a surveillance camera to see this suspension coming. Best of luck to you. Wow, that's some, that's some fire from Miss Grant. As per our discussion about the new campus surveillance system, Miss Grant has informed me that her petition was only one avenue of protest. While we initiate this new era of Blackwell security, we must find a middle ground between safety and privacy for our students. Best Principal Wells. At least he has one weird fan. Dear Mr. Madsen, I just wanted to let you know, I think it's BS what happened to you and the school has too many libtard metrosexuals um, who don't appreciate you or the military. That was an odd, okay. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge and I thought about you protecting me. I hope you will come back to Blackwell and make sure we are all safe at night. I am scared of this school. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. What about vape? Um, I mean, I, I wouldn't say that I condone any form of smoking. I mean, I don't really know how I feel about the marijuana world, but like nicotine smoke, it's just not good for you. Like, I know that it's, you know, people have troubles with it and I, it's not something that just easily like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna quit. Um, but for, for people out there who do smoke, I hope that, you know, well, Okay, Rose Puff doesn't smoke, which I'm glad, but for people out there who do smoke, you know, I don't want to sound insensitive, but yeah, like I don't, I don't want people to do it, and I hope people don't, but, uh, yeah, and if you do, I hope you're getting the help you need to not. Um, I don't know about that one. It depends what you're vaping. Um, I apologize for my outburst yesterday in your office. I was upset about losing my position at Blackwell without a complete investigation of the facts and based solely on the claims of untrusted students. There is a cancer at Blackwell Academy and without me, it will continue to spread. Sincerely, Matson D. Um, is that a thing? 
Is that a thing? I, I don't know. I don't know. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts too. Hmm. Didn't we already know that? I thought we already knew that. Uh, uh. Oh, jeez. David is packing up wedding stuff too. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Mr. Madsen, thank you for your help with Nathan. It is appreciated. Best, Sean Prescott. Oh, okay. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Oh. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Joyce, you know I'm not good at explaining myself or why I act the way I do sometimes. I only know that nobody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Taking care of my family is my number one mission. Yes, I overstepped my bounds with surveillance and suspicion, and I am truly sorry and ashamed. But there are dark things happening in Ac Arcadia Bay. I have never told you. Oh, so he, like, knows stuff. You are my wife and partner, and I know we should have no secrets. I intended to tell you everything, but I wanted more proof. Instead, a student committed suicide on my watch. You kicked me out of my favorite home, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me... Dot, dot, dot. I mean, yeah, I, I kind of feel bad about the divorce thing, but... So, um, one, there's some, like, fishy business going on about the girl, Kate, who commits suicide, and we're trying to figure out more about that, about, like, why, what kind of led her to that. And two, um, one of Chloe's friends in this timeline, Rachel Ambers, went missing. And there's a lot of kind of fishy... I mean, clearly, anytime somebody goes missing, there's fishy business. Um, so they... Chloe and Max think that David knows something about the disappearance and why Kate killed herself. So we're trying to find oh. more information. Look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move his plank if I want to take the shot. Oh, okay. Excuse me. Just one picture, please. Photo. Click. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. <laughs> That's indoors. Move back. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. See, I'm not lazy. I'd eat Whoa, those eggs. <laughs> that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Wow, does he have to be hiding something? Some people just like... For once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, and I need to find a way to break this padlock. I was about to say, actually, we have all the time we okay. need. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Everything gets solved, don't worry. All right, sounds good. Crowbar. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. I wonder, is there an actual code? Because finding out the actual code probably would have been better so that I could uh, secretively. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates. Photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Twin pics. Oh. Pictures of me. Blackwell Academy. She knows something. Maybe she knew something about the Prescotts. Score. Back to Chloe now. Oh. 
You know, okay, so I thought if I went back, I would still have the pictures. But maybe I don't. Clever Edge, what it's is up? It's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. Looks like David already booked a room. Detective Foo Foo is on the ca- oh, call Chloe? Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I oh, hate okay, to secret cool. file Jack on. So. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Whoa. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Surveillance army. Well, let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Max. Now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. Whoa. Settle down, girl. We don't need none of that. No violence in this house. I'm sure there's going to be violence in this game, so. Oh, no worries. I didn't even know, so it's fine. No worries. This is like a really nice campus. Hey, Max, how you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. Oh, uh, hey. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend Chloe. Yeah. Cool. No, I'm just in my room. Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I Instead of in cool the, the school. Uh, it's a long story. Living there room. Are actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much. Oh anyway. snap! Wait. On that note. Blackwell duty calls. You're Remember, pre ordering? You're to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Unity, contest Unity came party, out like so I hope you'll be there to celebrate three years ago. Even though I'm sorry Do you mean you Origins? Photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. Yeah. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just... Get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. You're good. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. You good. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot for teacher. I was about Gross. to say, hey, Chloe's got You're the hot. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring them. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Yeah. How's she gonna get that dirt though? No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Uh oh. Skateboarder did. Hey. Hey. <laughs> So What's awesome. up, bro? Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. Way too much shit going on, man. Try going to Blackwell. All right, is something gonna happen? I'm gonna have to like do something about it. No. All right. Oh, the boys' dormitory. Wait, what? Wait, what? No need to go there now. Is it? What? Why is it the same door? Yeah, he's got skills. Uh, can I talk to you? No, I can just look at you. Hello, people. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. Makes me mad. Hi, Miss Grant. Hey. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. Whoa, wow. Throwing some freaking shade there, Miss Grant. There's a lot of people throwing shade. Um, recent events. I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, 
I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. Yeah. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. Wait. Weren't the whales in an alternate timeline? Or were there whales in this timeline too? I hope you do too. Uh, beyond science? I think this is beyond science. Nothing is beyond science except for our lack of knowledge. We may yeah. not know why. Yeah! Heck yeah, Miss Grant! That doesn't change reality. I am worried about I agree with reality. that one. I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not missing. <laughs> Thanks, it's Clever Edge. You as well. Dying animals? You think that's why all these animals are dying here? Well, our shoreline has been receding. Not to mention the daily contamination of the ocean. That's all you need to kill off sea and wildlife here. B. Unless you know something I don't. Toboggan, time travel. I'm gonna say time travel. What about wormholes and chaos theory? I like time travel stuff. The only wormholes in Arcadia Bay are underground. And chaos theory is just that. But if this is about time travel, <laughs> sign me up. All right. Would you really change time? Not after reading that Bradbury story, A Sound of Thunder. I won't give it away, but it involves dinosaurs and butterflies. Time is like a thread, Max. One tug and it all can unravel. Yeah. Um, Nathan? I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. You know him better. What? You probably know him better. I've tried. Nathan is a Prescott and with that comes a lot of baggage. Too much for one teenager. This week was the proof. Principal Wells did the right thing. I know. Nathan needs real help. Yes, he does, Max. I did try once. But Mr. Prescott didn't appreciate my help. I'll go there in a second. Hold your horses. I did see Nathan horses. leaving the campus looking angrier than usual, so maybe it's good you haven't found him. Hmm. All right. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Thanks, Miss Grant. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Oh, my sweet Kate. Okay. Clow dog. Oh, they're so chill. Coast is clear. See that sly little. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Yeah. Max didn't really seem to indicate any interest in Jefferson, besides the fact that he's a good photographer. So lame. We don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, that's because different. I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Glow dog. Give me the signal if Nathan Charcoal. or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Bat Max. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Oh, come on, that should be easy. Let's see. Vortuck Club sucks a word. Evan, of course. That's why no shits were given. <laughs> Evan rolls. Uh, skateboarding is not a crime. Oh, why, hello, Trevor and Dana. Okay. Oh, toilet paper. Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? Hmm. That bathroom has quite the amount of graffiti on it. Zach or Logan? Who knows? Bro's got a bro. Bro's got a bro. 
Ugh, skunkweed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. I'm gonna feel good in five minutes. Is that Hello, a lie? Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. There is no unique picture of reality. All right. I can Looks like that. one of the jocks Hawking. did care about Kate. Sorry, Kate. This can only be Nathan's room. Watch it not be Nathan's room. <laughs> oh, it's locked. Girl! Really? Man, we're doing a lot of crimes in this, uh... In this, in this, uh, here, uh, video game. A lot of breaking in, entering, vandalism. Or anything with clues. Max, now that David is not here, I need Chloe to set up, step up and stop acting out so much, but that won't happen. If you and her are getting mixed up in illegal crap, <laughs> like I'm doing right now, like breaking into Blackwell at night, I know it happens, so don't bother to defend or explain. I hoped you would get her back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. You could be such a good influence on her, unless you both want to play bad, but she can't keep blaming David now. I'm sorry, Joyce, even I get into shenanigans, but I'm trying to be a good influence on Clay. I know, Max. I forget you're all still teenage adults. Oh wait, what was that text? Dad? Oh, okay. I think those were old. Um, okay. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Build the soda bomb again? Smash? What? What are y'all talking about? Let's see what Nathan hides in here. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Okay. Rude. Holy shit. Oh. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. He's got an instruction manual. GB 17 nine millimeter pistol owner manual. All right, all right. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Okay. These films all have a dark pattern. That's a lot of films to all have a dark pattern. He doesn't have one comedy in there. I find that hard to believe. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What is with this dude? A girl looking into a guy's PC. Not good. Ha! <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. Whoa! He stole one of your selfies? No way, bro. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. <sighs> if only all your energy went into photography. Yeah, come it's on, Nathan. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. There you go. Good for him. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. Ray John, a teenage slash parent guide to anger management. That was pretty good. Oh wait, no, don't turn that on. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Uh, that looks like a totally fun show. The new show. romantics? Even Nathan has a light side. I don't know if I know the new romantics. Maybe they're not a real band. I kind of doubt it since everything else in this thing has basically been- That is so Chloe. Hey asshole, we need to talk or I'm going to tell everybody what you did and you're going to pay mudda effa. Oh my God, Chloe, oh, Chloe. Oh, so did he also drug Chloe? Did we know that? We might've known that. I really hope they were all consenting models. Nathan's your kind of guy. <laughs> That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <laughs> Bastard. I can rewind if he shows up, but I can't count on it. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, 
The Prescott's rule. Nathan is way into this party. Bad to Victoria sign. Chase. Hey, gorgeous. Let me know what you're wearing to the Vortex this week so I can wear something just as stylin' and expensive. I'm psyched about going and pick, uh, and I'm picking up some serious, oh, potty, potty favors. What? I don't know what that means. Foo-foo, hint, floor is dirty, okay. Steal the camera? I don't think I can. I even told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so we can get wrecked without hassle. If you're going to have an end of the world theme, then let's do it effin' on point, right? Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And Vortex. why Kate will get justice. Kate's gone wild. Okay, that's all. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. From Sean Prescott. Nate, I know this has been a stressful week and your mother and I are here to talk if we need be. Just make an appointment anytime. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour, but for now, let's stick to our prescrip your prescriptions. I need you calm and quiet while Pan Estates is being developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and, and I'll guide you into this room step by step as did my father. It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. This asshole town is going to get an enema along with a fresh brand. I want you to be ready to take over when the moment is right. Don't F up it. Don't F it up, son, your father. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. Christy. And far away. Tudo Bem from Brazil. Brazil. Little brother, it's been too long since I've heard from you, so please let me know what's going on in your exciting scholastic life at Blackwell. I brag to all my co-workers in the Peace Corps that my talented bro Nate got a full scholarship to one of the best schools in the world. Even though I can't always check my mail or phone, please, please, please send me some new photos of campus so I can live vicariously through your lens. I miss you and your pictures. And yes, mother told me you've been in trouble and father has been on your A word, but you have to either ignore him or stand up to him. You know, I love dad, Nate, but I'm also in a jungle halfway across the world because of him. He's a bully who inherited his, who inherited power, not wisdom, and the only way to win against one is to fight back. Don't let him change you into one of, one just for the family legacy. End of lecture. You're at school, so I just wanted to make you feel at home. Back to the mangrove. Mangrove? I don't know what that is. Mangrove? 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 Sending out good thoughts. Better write back or I'll have a Jaguar shipped to your dorm. XOXOXOXO, Chris. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Extreme diet suppressant. Available online without prescription. 100 pills, 250. Holy wow. moly. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells about the recent vets. Nathan, I'd like to apologize for the recent accusation. Your name and record speaks for itself. Sometimes students will use that to make their own name at Blackwell. I know your father was upset while I assure, have assured him that you would never bring a weapon to school. I don't want you distracted from school and I'm certain this matter will be settled by the end of the week. If you have any questions, you know I'm always available to talk. Okay, that was kind of a lot of information on that computer. Um, okay, you were saying that the floor is dirty. But I feel like I looked at the things on... Oh. I didn't see that. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? I don't know, girl. Let's find out what you're hiding. 
Blah, 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 blah. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Oh, I found a phone, did I? Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. We're gonna open the door. Diploma? That's so cute and ironic. Best son in the world. Nathan still has it around. His diploma sort of said that Nathan Prescott is officially the best son in the world. Sixth day of June, AD 2006, the parents, Sean Prescott. All right, let's get out of here. Well, he wasn't there. I was kind of hoping he'd be like right there when I opened the door. Oh, wait, no, I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Clo dog, what's up, girl? Hey, okay. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. I'm gonna feel real good? All right. I'm ready to feel good. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Oh! What are you doing in my dorm? Uh. You're no. such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Whoa. Make me ho. Hey! Max, get I in got there, this. Warren. Get the fuck out of my face. Oh! 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 You are so fucking dead. Putting the beat down on you, boy. Get off me, bro. Uh, hmm. <laughs> I mean, half of me wants to stay out of it, but I'm gonna stop, Warren. Warren, stop it! Come on. Oh, oh my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you—you're all dead. Uh oh. Let's go now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all. I say, bra. you. I don't know. Do I? Did I say, bra? Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. Oh, okay, I can't do anything. Darn. What year does the... Wait, what? Well, I would assume it's 2015. Damn, that was intense. It's set in 2015. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. Yeah, it was. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max wow, you're not sounding up. suspicious at all. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. All right, all right, Warren. Settle down. Settle down. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. Sup, Chiraka, bro? He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. I was about to say, do we have the money? What? How do, what? Did we? I don't remember getting money. But maybe we do have money? I don't remember. Oh, okay, so there are whales in this timeline as well.
That's a lot of whales to be beached. God. Illuminati. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. Me too, girl. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Oh, there's also a troll face oh, up what? there. You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, ha. do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. Yeah. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Um, Fuck yeah. Legally, I think you... the only country that you can eat whale is Japan. Absolutely. And I don't even so know if that's true that's anymore cool either. cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. <laughs> Marathi. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Yeah. Stop dicking around. There's a flyer. There might not be any Pan Estates by Saturday. Stop Pan Estates. Thanks to local industry, the shores of Arcadia Bay are now unfit for fish, birds, and even whales. It's time to stop Pan Estates development that is leading to the destruction of jobs, lives, and resources. Okay. Join the peaceful protests at Pan Estates HQ. Media and families, welcome. Noon at Saturday, October 12th. I think it does. Look at the whale pick? The whale pick? What whale pick? Or this do you mean just look at the whale? Oh, look at whale, take pick. Gotcha. Lighthouse. Oh, wow. Okay. Those beached whales look so awful. Still so majestic. That's like a lot of whales. How can all of this not be connected to a major storm? Oh, it won't let me take a picture. Or is there a different whale that I have to look at? Come here, whale. Photo. Heck yeah. Morbid as F. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. For real, though. Okay. I wasn't sure if that was still a thing or not, but... Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. Wonder Twins power activate! She's my partner. Shape of ice! Form yeah, of water. Cold. So let's Anybody? get to no. business. Where's my fucking money? I, I don't have the money, yet. Oh. Oh really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. You're no. welcome. Ha! Whoa! Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe. Uh, here. Wonder Twins have so been a want? thing way before Teen Titans. Of, Although I love the Teen Titans. Clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Crap. Wait, I didn't see. No, you don't look to type at all. I like Chloe here, so. What do you want, Hardy? Oh. What? I don't know what to say. You don't get it. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. 
No, man. Adventure time is better. Good, especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I... Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Whoa! Get it, get it. Set the fuck back now! Oh shit. Oh! You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! What? <laughs> what? Was that gonna happen no matter no. what I <laughs> Chloe? Oh! I just shot a man and his dog. I killed Frank Bowers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it, it was self defense for both <gasps> of us. Max? <gasps> Frank is really dead. I know. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. So... It won't let me rewind. I can't rewind. Um... That's it. Maybe Let's after this cutscene I can. Sorry, Frank. Um, I'm sorry. Does he die no matter what? Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. And only I can change it. Ah, uh, okay, so I can change what happened. I am gonna change what happened. I wouldn't normally, but eh, whatever. Listen. Okay, Chloe, if he if he dies I again, tell you for a fact then this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So Tell me exactly what I need to do here. Oh. Uh. I'm just gonna say be careful. Be careful, okay? Don't give Frank any excuses to go ballistic. We need his help, Chloe. You know, I'm not a total fuck up. Occasionally I can be both cool and careful. Like now, okay? Wow. Literally what you just said denies that fact, Chloe. Oh my god. Oh, look. Okay. No fight. Thanks Wait. Thanks for hearing me out, Frank. Look, we only want to talk. Okay, so I guess... It's not even about you. That was weird. We're not here to start a fight. No, that shit would be over pretty fast. Don't fuck with me, and I won't return the favor. You're so right. You want. It would have been over pretty Just fast. The names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? L.A.J., what's up? Uh... I'm sorry. Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. I... I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I... I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. 
I was just... Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay. We're cool for now. But my dog isn't. And if you try <laughs> any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Yes, I'm so excited for The Last of Us number two. Um. Oh, Pompadour is so cute. The only way you know my dog's name is if you broke into my RV. That's how we got out. You did it. Are you crazy? Oh, that's what? my dog. Wait, that's not what. Seriously, Frank, don't get all spun out. We're only here to find Rachel. Rachel isn't in here, and I'll spin you on your ass. What the fuck are you dorks up to, huh? Trying to break into my business? This time, the price is wrong, skank. Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Oh my god, I did it again! I got us killed! <laughs> Whoops! It, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Alright, Frank's dead. It's official. Sorry, everybody. If you wanted Frank to survive, sorry. Chloe's gonna have to live with him. And the dog, too. Frank, Frank and the dog are dead. Put dog rescue? What? Now, I I screwed up twice, and those are my decisions. If you want the dogs to live, and 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 what's his face to live, then you'll have to play it yourself. But this time, Frank and the dog died. Whoops. Everyone's dying when I play this game. What Chloe, the heck? <laughs> are you okay? I'm sorry, I, I keep seeing Frank dead, and I'm the one who killed him. No way, Kate's death was the saddest, come on. I mean, Listen, Chloe's was sad too, you but saved my Kate's, life Kate's death was definitely the saddest. We have to keep going forward. I All better right. focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Investigate. Gather info on a chapter by selecting all the correct clues for each section. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Wait, what? Okay. What? But it... Oh, okay. I was like, it wouldn't even let me choose other things. So, oh my god, what? Can I... Is it like, based on what I select is what the information is, or... David should have done way more than take photos of Kate. At least David was finally going after the right suspect. Wow. David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. So, I'm confused. Am I... Uh, am I... Am I trying to gather information on... Kate or on Rachel? Okay, I'm going to select this one. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. The 
Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? Wait. Looks like this is not relevant at all. Okay. I'm confused. So is it going to tell me, like, what the right clues are, or do I have to figure that out for myself? Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. Okay. Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Oh, okay. See, now I actually like know what I'm looking for in this situation. Oh, Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. But that could still be useful. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. Right? Maybe Rachel took a road trip with Frank, but she did come back. So weird how close they were. But Frank couldn't keep Rachel. Or protect her. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but I don't think he would hurt her. Frank, that was not cool what you did. And don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me, and I thought you'd never chill out. I've never seen you act that way, and the next time will be the last. I'm a Leo, and we don't look back. I care about you, us, so maybe we need to break our routines. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Okay, I think that's a good one. Yes, the game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. I don't know what's going on. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. Holy moly. This is not like some just average drug dealer stuff. This is, uh... Okay. So, okay. Let's look at this. Okay, Max. Remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. So Nathan is rot. Okay. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Okay, so that has one rot in it. They got some GHB. I don't know what that is. Okay, but since it has him in it, we'll select that. Hmm. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Fire bud, speed, cocaine, and boondocks. Oh, that's that's where they did it. That's where they did the 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 drug or the deal, not what the drug was. Oh no, I got I got that. I got that. Okay, so that has nothing with Nathan in it. This makes no oh. sense, Max. Everybody oh. in Arcadia Bay must be high. <laughs> that explains a lot. Wait, okay. I just want to look at one of these. So... Someone spent $400 on one ounce? That seems ridiculous, but all right. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I don't really know drug stuff, but if Frank four hundred dollars on one ounce of his life, who am I to talk? Okay, that has nothing on there. I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. 
Okay, so that has two rots as, as well. Wait, what did he get? Skidoo acid and... Oh, and cocaine. Skidoo acid. Oh, yes. These are all the times and places... Yeah, for real, it must be deals. a good drug. Like, whoa. <laughs> That's it, Max. Okay, so we did that. I guess I didn't do what I was supposed to do for this. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Oh, okay. So that's what I'm trying to figure out. So this is probably a good thing. Um, hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. Okay, so that wasn't it. What is this? Rachel has been coming close to me. I don't think this relates, though, to what we're doing, because we're... What? No. Yeah, okay. This is not working. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spies are us. Uh, what? Looks like this isn't the right combination. Okay. So... What? Okay, so I would assume this is a good thing. And this talks about the Vortex Club, so I would assume this is also a good thing. Damn. I, I must have missed something. What? I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spies are us. So maybe it's just that. And that's all she wrote. But uh, <laughs> please let me find. Some but that doesn't make any sense because it has nothing to do with. Ca okay, whatever. All right, whatever, whatever. Great. Now, I mean, I get why those I three things are connected to each other, but like, okay, whatever. Okay, so, yeah, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. Oh my god. Oh, wait, wait, wait. oh, no, no, I just want to look at this. <sighs> Who else was David tracking here? Oh, okay, that's really helpful. So that's the license plate number. Oh, oh my god. Oh, thank god that's all I have to look at. Yep, another car David was tracking. Twin Peaks. Oh, I should look at that. So, this is Twin Peaks. Uh, that might just be a random license plate. That might not be anything. I don't think that's anything either. Maybe that's the only one that is something. Yeah, cuz I don't I don't or at least I don't want to know what those abbreviations were. <laughs> yes, it is. I mean, I've never done it, but yeah. Okay. Hmm. Who does this car belong to? Okay, so this one with that. Interesting. Is this Nathan's car? Yes, it is. We already knew that. <sighs> no. This oh. is not working. Oh, I see. So maybe. Deduce Nathan's license plate number, then match it up with the coordinates. Wait, what? There's Nathan dealing to the kids right out in the open. But, okay. Wow, sir. This looks like an expensive machine. That's definitely Chloe's car. Uh, okay. So that's Chloe's. Well, then I would assume that's Nathan's. Nathan. 
Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. Hmm. Okay, Nathan's tail light is busted. And I'm pretty sure I saw that on one. Maybe I should have let Warren beat Nathan's ass down. Just this once. Okay, so his tail light was busted. Of course, Nathan drives an SUV. Oh, okay. Yeah. Overcompensating. So. As usual. Tigger and Spurgler Burber. Wait. Tigger Burger Spur? Tigger Spur. So this one. Damn. Wait. No, no, no. I, I oh, must have missed that one. something. Uh, no. Yeah. Tigger to Spur, I swear. Oh, you're treading water. What? Over. Try again. It's a mix if a Persian cat in a sphinx. Wait, what? How does one find a cat like... Oh. Oh my god, what? Oh, because that one, the taillight's not busted. And this one, the taillight is busted. So... It's skibbit of scrotishba. Okay, I now see. Now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe, I, I need you to go online and help me decipher this. Chloe? Girl, she's freaking messed up. So. Chloe. Chloe, please listen. I know this is awful, but we're in it together, okay? I didn't have your back and I let you down. Please don't cry. Max, I'm... I'm gonna go to the police after we find Rachel. I can't live <laughs> keeping this a secret. Rose Pop, you do not I like Chloe. Be a teenage fugitive on the run, and and dude, I swear I, I won't even mention you. Okay, this is all me. No, Chloe, I'm sticking by my decision. I know you're hurting, but you have to just block out everything and keep moving just forward. Just because times are hard Rachel doesn't mean you just. Rewind. Can't do that. Yeah. Okay. Because sometimes right. stuff goes Focus down. On Rachel. It's all about Rachel now. Okay. We will. And I know this week has been so weird and fucked up. But Chloe, oh. I, this has to be our destiny. Or at least one of them. Let's just... Find out where this is all going to end, okay? Oh, I would definitely for be messed Rachel. up. For Kate. I would definitely be messed and up. And for Frank. He was dragged into this bullshit, too. That's my Chloe. Now let's be a lean, mean research team. But You have to go online and help decipher these coordinates. Because they might finally lead us to Rachel. Here we come, Rachel. I'm just saying. Thanks, Chloe. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. There's a lot of numbers in here. Okay. Why not give it a shot? Oh. Okay. Holy shit. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Okay. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. Oh, that was easy. What? Peas can't effing fight. You f up my door. I kill you. Scholarship. Okay. Start you do hacking. that, Nathan. 
Okay, so it's going to be a four-digit thing. Let's see. I'm going to try 9535. Bad code. All right, so that's not it. Let's see. I doubt it's a phone number. Maybe it's the pin. Uh, there's one more chapter after the chapter we're doing right now. So we'll have one more chapter. I guess I'll try one, 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 one. I feel like that's dumb, but. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Maybe it's zero, zero, zero. No, I'm just kidding. Um. Five, four, two. And then it's just something. Um, try one, two, three, four. All right, I'll try it. Just a humor. You locked it, dumbass. Oh, no. All right, let's just try something else. Zero, zero, five, eight. Oops, bad code. Oh, whoops. Um. I'm gonna try five, four, two, something. Oh. What? Oh, that's just looking at it. Oh, wait. Maybe if I look at it... No. Okay, that's not telling me anything. I was like, maybe there'll be, like, little finger marks on his... On his phone. Oops. Bad code. Oops. You locked it, dumbass. How you use time travel powers, Oops. unlocking people's Bad phones. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. I might be trying to do something that isn't a thing. Does anybody know the code? Oops. Bad code. Okay, I'm giving up on that. Oh, man. Okay, let's see. Five, four, three, one, four, four, five, four, three, one. Oops. Bad code. Okay, it's not that. Four, four, three, six. Is that what that is? Yeah. Four, four, three, six. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Bah! Nine, nine, eight, eight. Oops. Bad okay. code. Zero, zero, eight, nine, five. Oops, bad code. That wasn't it. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, let's try some of these phone numbers, I guess. Let's see, home fo phone, phone, home phone, cell phone, work phone.
You got messed up, it changes? Are you serious? No, what? Zero, one, nine, eight. Oops. Bad code. Okay, did I do all the codes on here? I think I, oh, it's three, nine, eight, eight. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that okay. easy. Use the puk number. Just keep messing up. Eight, seven, eight, nine. Wait. Eight, seven, eight, nine. Bad code. <sighs> yeah, I knew it. Oh. Okay. It's weird. But all right. Eight seven eight nine seven eight zero eight. Can people put that in? Eight seven eight nine seven eight zero eight. Eight seven eight. Eight seven eight nine. Eight seven eight nine. What was what was the last part? Eight seven eight nine. Uh, eight seven eight nine. Seven eight zero eight. Let's find out what Nathan oh, yeah. Prescott has been trying to hide. Yeah, nice. What up? Need the G? Okay, cool. B word, you sold me water, a-hole. Calm down, bring it to me. Bring it, stay away, pigs on the beach. Yes. What? Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. You home, got to party tonight. Home, on my way. Load the bowl. Ethan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Hey, I need to score ASAP. I don't make house calls. You have a car. No time. Charge me double. Dan dang right. Have cash on you? No effing around. Give me your address. I'll call to give you the exact directions. In transit. Get the Drug that money. Drama. Uh, you up, bro? No S word. What you need, peruvial flake, skidoo acid. You're paying night prices, don't make me wait. Sorry for being a D. Need more stuff, you home? Yes, don't come, F off. God, Nathan, you're out of control. Hey, need weed, etc. now, calm yourself, you tweaking. Soon, hook a brother up, please. Meet Beach, be cool this so time. So it was you. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything, or I'm stalker. coming for your A. I know where you no, sleep. No, Nathan. It's time for you to watch out. Ask hey, me. war. Feminazi will be exterminated. Watch out. Is this out. from Nathan's father? Please do not That's contact brutal. me at work. I've told you this before, and being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can get things done on his own? Impress me. I'd like nothing more to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. Harsh. All right. War. All right. Oh, investigate. What am I investigating? Take a breath, oh, Max. my gosh. Go through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Holy crap. This is getting crazy. Uh. 
Oh my gosh. Ten one, ten four, ten four, ten seven, ten seven. So, oh. this infamous party was the fourth. Okay. So it was on the fourth. So that was 10 4. Oops. Oh. That's all one thing, I guess. Oh, wait. Oh, I can only select one from each. What does this say? I feel like this is... Better. 930. 10-4. Okay. I should see if there's a different 10-4. 10 10 10-07. Oh, wow. There's a lot 10 7. Okay, 11 p.m. What does this say? 10. 5. Okay. So, select that. What does this one say? I know if it, if you want me to just say, oh, no, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. So that was later in the day, so I'm guessing we want the evening one. Um, was Frank meeting Nathan at the junkyard? 10-3. That beach is like Frank's main office. Not much out there. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot in the forest. Somebody is stocking up on gas. No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So he could be hiding clues there too. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. <sighs> Poor, rich Nathan. If Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. I was going to say, it's probably the barn pick. Because that's the only one that's a 10-4 on it. Bam! Chloe, this is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. There's some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. Dang, girl! I'm on this. Hold Stop on. Stop getting so crazy. You're the one who shot... Okay, that's really unfair, but... <laughs> Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. I'm shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. Yeah. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like there you go. To find we Rachel. have the power. We have to find her, Max. We will. But Whew. remember, Oh my gosh. My power isn't infinite. Wow, this has been a long chapter. Be this has been a long chapter. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. This has been a long chapter, y'all. They're gonna get hot in heaven? I guess not. I guess they do not. Heavy. Shit, this is scary. I know, but we're here. Let's go find the best way in. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. 
Dude, somebody was just here. Maybe you should then get you the F out of there then. Just maybe. So Chloe and me actually killed somebody. No. Um, Chloe these killed are someone. Thick tracks and definitely fresh. You did not kill anyone. Nathan's SUV? Warren. It's a lot of text messages. Thanks for pulling me off, Nathan. Talk about going ape. He deserved a beatdown, but I still don't want to stoop to his level. Besides, somebody is going to kick his A sooner than that. Sooner than later. You are wise, Grasshopper. Thanks, but I wasn't exactly the hero this town needs. That's That was the perfect moment for she, her to say, but you are the hero this town deserves. Come on. You got in every other pop reference. Put some Batman in there. Now is when the real deal starts? Uh-oh. You still paid your hero's hero dues. Now we just need costumes. Speaking of, I hope you're coming to party tonight so we can celebrate. I'll let you know, promise. Cool, now I have to calm myself down. All right. Uh, Chloe! I found the front door! Coming up, Come on. so you better get this party started. I'm coming up, I'm coming! Oh, yes! Maximus rules. God, this is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Okay, girl, you've clearly never seen the Blair Witch. But, alright. Hey, check out this old chest. A little louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Uh-oh, not the real no, star. Look closer. The Harry real deal, sorry. Family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescott's bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. Yeah. Okay, so they said there was fresh... Oh, it's this yes, tractor. Okay. Old Prescott clippings. But that can't be the only thing here. This tractor has paid its dues. Okay. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. July 22nd, 1903. Wow, we're going way back. Uh, Martin Lewis Prescott, Prescott Ranch, Arcadia Bay, Oregon. Dearest Mr. Linden, I'm writing in regards to your outstanding debts that you have chosen to ignore. The Prescotts may not be established, may not be established business gentlemen but we are businessmen and expect our due we take your silence as a personal insult and thus dedicate our family name to making you pay your debt with 10 percent interest plus a written apology if these conditions are not met by the end if the day by the end if the day july 24th in the year of our lord 1903 Rest assured, we will make sure we will make your life a living hell. Kindest regards, Martin Lewis Prescott. All right. Yeah, that was a little harsh. I would have to agree. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be. Well, if wow, it's their sir. farm. Talk about home on the range. Yeah. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Well, don't be so negative dancy and press them and find out if they actually will. Come on now. I know, this has been a really long chapter. This has been the longest chapter so far. These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th reference, there you go. So many haystacks. So few needles. All right, come on now. So many haystacks, so few needles.
Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Chloe would make a great detective too. Okay, wait. What, what did I miss? Didn't I look at everything? Oh, ground. I didn't look at the ground apparently. <sighs> Nothing here. <laughs> Scope out the perimeter locks. There has to be more here than this crate. Just rotting wood. All right, just rotting wood. You really shouldn't just be messing around. Hey, look, there's if Jason's pitchfork. I have my weapon. No, oh. or if a zombie shows up, it's not. It's not for Jason to come kill us. But wait. Hold. Hold. What's that? I hear metal. I hear metal. Metal, 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 metal! Whoa. What is this? It's totally brand new. Why? Maybe because someone just installed it there. No, about Super that Max. Way? You can't open this with your bare hands. Why not? Look up, brah. Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but... Ah. <sighs> The good old days. Eggs, bacon, sugar, coffee, cocaine, tobacco, milk. That's not bad. Although the fact that a coffee would have been a dollar and eggs would have been 14 cents. Well, actually, that's actually not that crazy. But still. Platform. Look. <sighs> The rope leads up to that platform. Must climb. Must climb! Chloe, can you give me a hand? Whoa, 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 whoa. Sidekick what? Sidekick at your service. Recipe for a good morning, cocaine and, and coffee. You'd be set for the day. Oh, I'm away, Eggs, Super Max. bacon. I dig having minions. What? I missed that. I missed that. <laughs> I was about to say, don't drop that on yourself, dang girl! That looks sturdy enough to stand on. Don't kill yourself. Dang girl. Here's the other end of the rope. Most of this live stream is investigating. I would agree. I would agree. Uh photo of the owl. I was about to say, is that a live owl? Hey, little dude. Good evening, Doctor Who. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Sorry. Lol. Oh, uh, I didn't even know I could, like, look at the photos. I'll look at those later. We don't need to look at them. Uh, um, what am I doing? Something with these ropes? Can just look at them. Climb up there. What? Um. What? Oh. There we hey, go. Chloe, can you attach the hook to that? But it's entertainment for you. Oh, you are nice. Clever. Good. I'm glad. I'm all over this. I'm glad it's entertainment. Hint. Rewind. Not. Then you better step away from that hatch. Oh, uh, because there was something else I was supposed to do. Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. What? Okay. Wait. What? No. What? Stop. Stop. Oh. Okay. What? The hook is attached pretty tight to the rope. I could use it to open the hatch. Pull? Oh, 
So that didn't work at all. What? Are you sure about that? Okay. Now I like attach that to it something else or something. No, Max. Try again. Or did I just screw up? Oh, maybe I just screwed up. Seems like I screwed up. But what? Why am I? What? Why am I up here? What? So confused. That made no sense. Uh, climb. I guess I went. I went too far back. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. There we go. There we go! Attack. Okay, skip this. Wait, what? Oh, now push this up. What? What? Max okay. Diver strikes again. I guess that worked. I guess that worked. Whatever it was, what'd you say? Oh, you just told me how to do it. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Damn, this is heavy. Oh! What is this? Secret Check underground that. basement! Conspiracy theory, Illuminati Do I confirmed! Need to see how weird this is? He just did. Who built this kind Gavin of Gavin in the woods! A press god, of course. Popcorn! Two five four, two five four, two, five, four two, five. Now get ready. What are we gonna find out that they like were this some bunker is so surreal. Okay, so Oh, I bet it's five four two. I bet it's five four two. Bam! Oh, First yes. try. I thought that only worked in the movies. Open sesame. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Nice try, though, Scarlet. What is this? A bomb what the shelter? Hell is the water supplies? It's like in David's garage bunker. Oh my gosh! Did the Prescotts know that the end of the world was coming? Look at these cans. Maybe David the Prescotts can the also time store. travel. Kind of doubt it, but more survivalist supplies. I guess we'll find out. Letta. Whoa. This says it all about Nathan. Dear Mr. Prescott. He needs help. As Nathan's primary physician for over five years, I feel that I should stop seeing your son as you have disregarded my rather die in immediate suggestions for his and others' well-being. You know well the extent of Nathan's challenges, but I feel that you refuse to acknowledge the role you play in his mental health. If I do not have your support, I cannot treat Nathan. It is, a si it is as simple as that. I fear he is becoming even more disconnected from reality. 
even if he acts in a personable way manner, you have ignored my request for a consultation with you and your wife, so I have to assume you are no longer interested in my services. Regardless, I care about Nathan and believe he needs serious help. If you would like to talk about this matter, I am always available. Best, Dr. Jacobi? J J Jacobi? Jacob? Jacobi? Creepo. Indeed. Indeed. Stuff's getting crazy up in here. in a bunker is always a bad sign. I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. Yeah. What's with the Prescott's and creepy art? They're all psychopaths. Whoa, they got some serious files on people. Ooh, even Rachel. Come Maybe on. they're all just Let's blackmailers? All about. We are. Okay. Maybe that's how I they get all their money. Victoria, they're all just blackmailers. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex. Whoa, Park. so they plant? Oh my god. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think mm. so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. I gotta. There's no way she's that, dead. No yeah. Way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. I kind of thought she was dead, to be honest. Like from the beginning. Blade shot. Oh Welcome God. back as well. Thank Rachel, you. Kate, all these files. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Dear Nathan, Principal Wells has informed me that you have been suspended due to some suspect, some, some suspect Vortex Club activity on your part. Never mind that. I just want you to know what kind of shame you've once again brought on this family. I've given you everything you've ever wanted, including Blackwell Academy, among other things we shall not mention. But nothing is never is ever enough for you. You're still my son, and I want you to fulfill our destiny. That day is coming sooner than you think, so be prepared to step into that responsibility. This is my final warning. S. Prescott. Sean Prescott. This picture is framed different. Things just got so juicy! Rachel is awake and fucking furious. Yes, I have been playing Rachel Destiny 2. Rachel passed out, and she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. Oh, well, girl, <clears throat> it is real. So. Let's see what's in here. Oh wow. Oh my god. No. So I did some photo editing of Kate. Whoa. What is going on between Nathan and his father? You done raid yet? I have done the raid, yes. Uh, Nathan, I've told you to never call me using your phone. Stick with the disposable ones I give, gave you. I don't want to hear you screaming out my name in a public space, which you have stupidly done before. I haven't set all this up and shared my vast wisdom just so you can F it up with your teen rage. We can accomplish a lot together, but you have to let me guide you. You're or you're on your own. All right. That son of a bitch. Howard Rogue Construction, Stormbreaker Bunker. Whoa, what? Full estimate, 1350650 dollars. Contract, signature, Sean Prescott. That is a lot of money. Talk about tortured. 
Yeah, dang. Okay. I know that Rachel's important, but I want to look around this place as much ah, as I can. the Apocalypse Entertainment System. I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. These feels... Tripod. So who's using this fancy tripod? Who do you think? The Prescotts. Oh my gosh, come on now. Let's mess up their white sheet. Ha ha ha, getting all dirty. Now you can't use this. Ha 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 ha. Sorry. Bottle. Somebody likes their whiskey. Someone likes their NHS too. Frank won't be around to push this stuff. Needles. Gross. Yeah, they got some serious drugs up in this operation. That's an I mean, original signed illustration. What? Fits perfect in here. I will, uh, yep, I will do some more Bloodborne. Don't you fret. Don't you fret. Okay, I already looked at all that stuff. Okay, let's get out of here. I was about to say, watch somebody be outside, or maybe not. Drift in. That's not what she said, though. She just said, slow down. Wait, wait, wait for me. <laughs> Look, this is it. This is it. I know this is a depressing moment, but these Are you jams. Help me, Max? They're just friggin' awesome. Holy, stop. Look. Please, no. Girl, come on. We knew this was coming. Oh. That smell! Rachel! Oh. No, Rachel, no, no! Please, not her! <laughs> Chloe. <laughs> Rachel, why? I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. I loved her so much. We know. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? Rip, Rachel. Oh, is that the deer? I was like, what is that? But who's the deer? Oh. Uh, wow. Is the chapter <clears throat> not over? Oh my gosh. Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, oh, we can crap. go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. Whoa, girl. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is going to get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. No, no, that, what? Mm -hmm. All right.
Yeah, um... You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too Jesus, moved. Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Thanks, thanks, Ultimate Call. Nathan is Count dangerous. Me out. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> no, no, <laughs> he's he's been sober as allowed. Drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey, I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know, I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture, uh... Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Dang, Sorry. girl! I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. Yeah! Hey, I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. I think that's kind of what he was hinting at, girl. <sighs> that he's invisible to you because you just kind of toss him aside. So, sorry, Jabroski. Uh, Hi, club Hi. music party. Sorry. No, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Yeah. <laughs> Where the hell are Two they? moons, yeah, that's normal. Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It is kind of nasty. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? No. That's why I didn't talk uh, to no you. No thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? Yeah, no, for real, for instance. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. What girl? What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Hair dance. Do you notice anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I noticed they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have canceled the party. Yes, I'm not cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I I just need to find Nathan. There's freaking two moons Don't outside! Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Okay. That's why I didn't want to talk to her, but all right. Oh, it's a pool party. Ah. That's actually kind of cool. I feel like that'd be a pretty fun party. That party's pretty lit. That's a pretty lit on campus party. 
Max. Sorry, that was so annoying. Uh, Alyssa, hey, are we friends again? Hey! Hey! Oh, oh, I didn't mean to hurt myself. Do I just stand in the way or something? Oh, I got you, girl. <laughs> Who doesn't have two moons? Oh, I'm let's talk to her. To see you here. Uh, Vortex Club. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This what? Was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of Oh, crap. I forgot to set up my Streamlabs again. Even if I hate most of them. Well... I have 149 subs, but woo -woo! thank you whoever subbed. Thank you so much. That's awesome. Shout out to all of you. Uh, Victoria. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or I kind of missed what was She that. must like punch her in the face. I probably should just for Vortex Club posterity. There you go. Nathan. Alyssa. I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Play like a New York club. Watch out for yourself. Why? When I have Max Caulfield at my side. Oh yeah, girl. Oh my god. We're gonna have such a good party. I love it. It's freaking awesome. All right, dude, settle down. All right, bouncer man. Wait, can I? I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Can I get Excuse in? Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a okay. shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Dang, girl. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. All right, let's go through here. Oh, look. Hey, Max. Nice. What are you doing in here? What? Apparently, Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. Oh, oh, gross. No, let's let's not like go over there. I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Oh, there's a this dude in the way. What? Um, kill the Prescotts. Holy moly. All right. I mean, yeah, the Prescotts are bad, but Never dang. Exit the Vortex Club. This is my last Vortex Club party. The tire liar. Is Such a liar. All right. I guess we're going over here. Oh, poor guy. Hello. Can you please hurl and flush away? Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Ugh, Max. Maybe Oop. you're not the only one who has to get sick. Uh oh. If you don't wrap it up, okay, so it, was there a point of coming in here? I don't know that there was. Jump in the water! Then you can get around. I'm so not impressed by this VIP. Yes, you do so. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Are you mental? You can't come in. What if I uh, bought you some uh, glow sticks? What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? Yeah. All right. Not sure what I'm supposed to do here, but uh. <laughs> um. All right. Oh, maybe you can get me in. No Come doubt. Um, but I actually have to go now. I'll talk to you later, Alyssa. Stop that! Oh! Oh no! Scammer down! 
<laughs> oh my gosh, camera down. I was I was jump stepping too hard. I guess. Okay. I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? No big deal. No big deal. Whoop, 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 whoop. You look pretty fucking intense. Is Nathan bothering you? I have no. dreams that somebody finally kicks his ass one day. Somebody Ooh, did. Sometimes dreams come true. Today I saw Warren give Nathan an epic head. Yes, give it up for Brother Warren. Now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. Dang, a lot of people do not like the Prescotts. That'll be hard to do when the Prescotts own the town. And the Vortex Club. Yeah. I call it the Vortex Cult. Look at this crap. Dress code? VIP section? Elitist bullshit. Preach it, Brother Luke. Okay, I have to get going. Yeah, you're still there partying, but, you know, whatever. Oh, thank you for helping Kate and for keeping it real. Peace out. All right, so he did not help me. This party needs a call. Hello, Brooks. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you... No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the Vortex. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Uh, no. what? I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the movies, but you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm selfish while you go on a route to help save your friend. You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise. That was like a swing out of left field from Brooke. I don't think we've ever talked I to her. That snow and eclipse but... gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Double moon. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, it might be. Night is still young. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. All right. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Girl, you move so freaking slow. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Crap. Okay, so she won't jump in the pool because she's lame. We can literally just jump in the pool and hopscotch into that freaking VIP. Uh, oh, what does this do? Is it actually 150 now? Whoa, 150! Stop. Stop. So I'm guessing. Oh. Now I'm over here. Oh. Okay. That worked out great. Nathan oh. is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. Okay, but everyone has been saying that he's not here, so clearly he's not. is next on Nathan's hit list. Should I warn her? Okay. Let's see. No, because all that's going to happen is if we go up and talk to her, she's going to be like, Why the hell are you here? Oh my god. Yay, Max! I can't wait to see 
can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. No. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. <laughs> Trevor. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. <laughs> He's so different than Logan. Yeah. He actually talk about life. Oh, And he knows nice. how to be safe. Yeah. I hear you, Dana. No pregnancy. I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. The Vortex Club is also enabling him. I know. Juliet wrote a story describing it like a cult, and I'm starting to think she was right. It's not fun anymore. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. <laughs> Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. The drama. That sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. All right. This <laughs> party was fun, but dance, I'm ready Look to move that. on with this party. All right, let's just talk to Victoria. Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. Oh! Go fuck yourself, in Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Whoa! Thank you, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh killed herself in front of you and me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. Don't blame. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. It's more than stupid. It's mean. Hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Max, I saw Kate Marsh die. I swear it didn't feel real to me. I kept thinking, did I cause this? Did I? I felt like shit ever since. I believe you, Victoria, but I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what, I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer. Not president. Okay. All right. You have talent. You have talent, Victoria. I'll try to be the you bigger person here. Push people out of your way. You don't understand. For this girl. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Uh. At least we're not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Yeah. Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, yeah. Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's going to happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. Uh-oh. Yeah, um... Hmm... I don't know because if I warn her it's like okay I warned her and it's out there even if she doesn't believe me but if I don't warn her then there's not like that awkward like are you crazy what are you talking about I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna tell her I'm just gonna tell her Victoria listen to me your life is in serious danger I know Nathan is your friend but he is truly unstable and dangerous he did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Thanks, yeah. 
Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. Yeah, and I didn't think she would. would. He do that? that I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. My treats him like a <laughs> Thanks, Rosebuff. Thanks, Diego Gamer. Thanks, Scarlet. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I oh, haven't Oh, thank seen God. Him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you. Two hundred subs coming soon. Let's hope. Let's hope. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. Oh, changing it up. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. I'm glad. Oxygen I'm kit. That oxygen kit might come in handy if somebody pins you. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely oh. not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. There's Mr. Jefferson. Nathan, he's hiding in his dorm. And let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Oh. No. <laughs> okay. You look like you're on a okay. Mission. Oh, I don't know what college parties just, exist in the world in where a teacher would uh, ever uh, be at them, but I didn't know you were pals with him. All right. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. Thanks, Scarlett. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Get the hell out of here. They announced that at a party? This is a weird college. <laughs> University, whatever. <laughs> okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. I was about to say, does this everyone at the school love is the him? the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Ah, oh, Mr. Jefferson. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! Guess who, Doctor Who? What? Oh. Good job, Victoria! Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought okay. me to Okay, oh and my gosh. I up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. Yeah, you are, expert gamer. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. Wow. All right. Victoria, Settle down. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Yeah, are you really that surprised? Is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories.
Okay, this girl went from like being super upset that she killed someone to like really wanting to kill someone, but- Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Oh, oh crap. Two moons. Junkyards. Nathan's. Oh, there's only one moon now. Oh, uh, what? Huh? What? Um, all right. What? Stop stomping around, Chloe. <laughs> Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you should have moved the body. Cow meows! What's up? I'm not gonna believe. Oh, sorry. So creepy out here. Cow meows is legit. Just so y'all know. I actually think Cow Meows has a his own channel. So check that out. He's awesome. Oh my god! Kick your revenge. I swear. What the frig of that frack? Feeling good? Good. Glad to hear it, Cow Meows. You're gonna suffer, Nathan. Alright, girl, settle down. You already killed a dog and a person. Yeah, we don't need another person on our hands. Max, please hurry. But you are near the end of the channel. Oh, God, Max, oh look. episode, yeah. She's still there. Truth. Don't look, Chloe. Girl, <gasps> whoa! <laughs> What the fuck? Oh! Okay, talk about a swing from left field. What? I didn't really like that. I mean, I did like it because it was a great, it was a great thrill, shock twist at the end there. I appreciate that, but I do not like that that just happened. What? Oh my gosh. Okay, so <laughs> I was not expecting that. Um, I was like, I was kind of expecting, I was like, okay, so... I, I knew they were gonna get jumped and stuff. I was not expecting Chloe to die. And, well, I guess I don't know if she's dead. She got shot, but I would assume that she's dead from that. Yeah, yeah, okay. And I was not expecting Mr. Jefferson. The only thing that was maybe hinted at that was at one of the past chapters when it's like doing like the checking in with like everybody, which it didn't do in this chapter. Um, 
it showed him doing something with someone, and that was kind of, like, inconspicuous. And, I, I don't know, did it mention that... Did it mention that he was clo had a close relationship with Nathan? I, I don't feel like it ever did. So... Twas a headshot, yeah. Well, yeah, I, I don't know. That was crazy. That was that was definitely one of my favorite chapters. It was a little long, I have to say. It was a little long, which some of the parts it was just like it, it just droned on, kind of like it was like, all right, let's 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 get to the point here. But um, so that was yeah, it was a little long, but it was good. I enjoyed it. Um, we'll do with the final chapter tomorrow, I guess. Uh, if you like this video, please do smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. Um, I hope you enjoyed the craziness and my my dubstep lights that I made happen <laughs> throughout the thing. Um, it was a good time, though. Um, so, once again, updates for my channel. Uh, today is... The exception today, I know this is my usual time, but now start checking in about six hours later for um, for streams. So they're going to be happening a lot earlier now, which is kind of unfortunate because I know this is a pretty good time for a lot of people to do it in the evening. Um, but I won't be able to do that. I, I might do like a afternoon stream and like a late night stream. Uh, we'll see. Um, but that's just kind of where I'm at right now. So... We'll, we'll see what I do with that. Because, you know, I kind of like... I like having our, our two streams daily. Um, which I know... I mean, like, I I just started today after doing it for, like, not a month. But uh, <laughs> it's been a while and, and all that good stuff. Um, um, all right, Rose Puff, Thanks for watching. But, yeah, if you like this, smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. And I will catch you all in... Um, the next life, not the next life, but the next stream. Uh, yeah, I'll figure out when, when is best to do my streams, but, um, yeah, the starting at when I usually start, it just isn't going to work for the most part. So I'll figure something out. Um, still more, still more. What do you mean? Still more. You mean there's still more to this game? Yes, I know that. Um, there's one more chapter. But, yeah, all right. Um, I'm going to sign off for tonight, and then we'll probably start doing two daily streams. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do after Life is Strange. Maybe we'll do Until Dawn. I, I don't know. We'll see. Um, I kind of like doing these, having, like, a choice game and maybe, like, a more action-based game. I might do some Destiny 2 um, streams, and I'll start a new character with that. Um and that but yep all right i've talked enough leave a comment below if you like this what you want to see more of what do you want to see less of and all that jazz so yeah have a great night thanks for watching